Returning from New Zealand dressed in all black, Taylor Auerbach landed in Sydney as the federal court prepared to release his explosive affidavit. The journalist worked as a producer on the Seven Network's Spotlight program, which aired two interviews with Mr Lehrman last year. At the time, the network said it didn't pay for the interviews, though it was later revealed to have covered Bruce Lehrman's rent for a year. Mr Auerbach now claims the former Liberal staffer received several payments while Seven was trying to lock in the deal. The affidavit alleges Seven reimbursed Bruce Lehrman for illicit drugs and prostitutes over two nights in January last year, though Mr Auerbach concedes he no longer has a copy of the invoice. It also details payments for Thai massages worth more than $10,000, though Mr Lehrman says he didn't get one, three weeks in a property in Sydney's East at almost $12,000, meals at Sydney restaurants coming to more than $1,500, and expenses from a golf trip in Tasmania totalling almost $2,000. It's the latest twist in Bruce Lehrman's defamation case over the interview in which Brittany Higgins first detailed her rape allegation. His criminal trial in the ACT collapsed due to juror misconduct, leaving no findings against him. Network 10's lawyers have revived the case to establish if Mr Lehrman gave Channel 7 material from the brief of evidence it shouldn't have had under court rules. Bruce Lehrman denies this. A Seven spokesperson said the network will not reveal its source and did not condone or authorise the payments Mr Auerbach refers to. But the affidavit also reveals just how early Mr Lehrman and Seven were in contact. Some of the payments occurred before the ACT's then top prosecutor had officially dropped the case. Mr Auerbach is expected in the witness box tomorrow. Patrick Bell, ABC News.